Many immigrants moved to the United States to live what they call the American dream. But for the Sosa Soto family, it has become more of a nightmare. I'm the one who's working right now. Antonio Sosa Soto, your typical 17-year-old senior. My mom, she has an order for deportation. It's just really tough right now since she doesn't work anymore. Antonio's mother, Lourdes, was detained by immigration and lost her job. Now Antonio works after school at a local gas station. It's a lot of pressure. Just I try it just this time because I don't have work. Lourdes cuts hair at home to help bring in a little extra money for the family, but it is not much. Lourdes now struggles to pay the bills and is in the process of looking for an apartment more affordable for her and her family. Lourdes has a court date in February to determine the outcome of her deportation. Oh, when I'm not working, I come here and play with my little brother. So which is our side and which is their side? I don't know. Antonio, born in Mexico, will benefit from Minnesota's DREAM Act. I want to attend a four-year university, maybe criminology. Lourdes fears her son will not be able to fulfill his dream of going to college if she is to be deported in February. People that come here, like, they just want to work. They come to work because they don't have it good in their country, so they come here instead. <laughs>